go out by myself. I spend a lot of time with people. I don't know why I've always been like that. So today I'm dedicating the day to myself and just going out, doing whatever I want by myself. was so nice i asked for a small because they're doing a two dollar special and she gave me a medium cup with extra boba i was like oh my god we go in there all the time for the specials it's on thursdays and saturdays so that was really nice out for a couple hours i went to a bunch of new stores i've never been to so that was really nice i had that croissant i've been dying to get pastry from that little coffee shop i like working in there or just like sitting and chilling for a while but getting a little later so i'm gonna head to the bus and if you're wondering why i take a bus it's because i don't have my driver's license i'm lucky to live in the city so there's all this public transportation that's easy to get around so i'm fine with not having a license
So it's been a couple hours later. My mom made us dinner. She made us a little mummy dog and french fries and a little basket, which was really cute and festive for the holidays. I showered, washed my hair, and I'm letting it air dry and just getting myself ready for bed. It's kind of hard still living at home and having time to myself. When I was younger, or pretty much my whole life up till 20, I shared a room with one of my siblings. So I never really had like a place to go just to be like by myself. Like if I was having a bad day, like I was in my room with my sibling. Um, at one point I shared a bed too. Like before I had bunk beds from like maybe 12 till 19. But before that I shared a bed. So it's always been kind of hard when I'm having a bad day and I'm, you know, with people. I'm so used to being always with people that I don't know how to be by myself. Like I'm just like, okay, if you want to do something, go ask somebody. Like I'm still kind of like that and I need to get out of that because I need to be independent and I don't need to depend on other people. That's why I'm like not really sure if I'm introverted or extroverted. In high school, like I hated going out. Anytime like people would invite me out, I would go but then hate it and want to go home, which I've done. So I'd rather be at home than be out with people. But then I realized I can't do anything in silence. Like I always have music playing or a video playing. Like I'm never in just silence. So I'm not really sure if I'm an extrovert or introvert, maybe in the middle, but it was kind of nice just to be by myself and not have to ask anyone what they wanted to do next. I mean, I enjoy going out with, you know, friends and my boyfriend like a lot, but I do need to prioritize just me time. I just forget that I can do that. So maybe next time I'll push myself to go into Center City and like, like go out to eat by myself, get a table for one. I've never done that before, which I don't think it'll be bad i just never have so i'm usually in town with someone and probably another thing that would be kind of hard to do would be like go to a concert by myself i know a lot of people do that but for some reason for me i don't know why that kind of scares me because like if i get lost i'd rather be lost with someone than be lost by myself so maybe i can build up to that maybe i can make that like a series on this channel like trying to do things alone so i could become more confident maybe it's just because i get so anxious like my social anxiety kind of like gets in the way and i think of the worst but I can't always do that but today was nice I did go to places I've been but I also went to new stores that I'd never been into that I don't know if I necessarily would go in if I hadn't gone today because me and my boyfriend like to walk around there a lot so it was nice just it being me but I still am so surprised that the, the lady gave me so much extra like I all I did was ask for extra boba she gave me a bigger cup and extra everything which was so nice and the croissant was good too but maybe not my favorite I wouldn't go out of the way to get it it's still a, it's always a vibe in there and I just drank water while on my computer but yeah definitely gonna try maybe going into town by myself like I've gone into town to meet someone by myself but not just walked around town by myself the only thing with taking public transportation is just like the waiting like I'll be checking this up the app seeing when something's coming or when it's gonna come next and then it doesn't I'm like bruh why couldn't this just come on time for me like I think coming home I waited like 30 minutes for a bus and it was packed when I got on like they the next stop nobody was able to get on because of how packed it was but I'm gonna put my heatless curler in and then call it a night for me I hope you guys enjoyed hanging out with me today let me know in the comments if I should do this again if you want to keep up with me every day you can follow all my socials link down below don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in my next video bye